In this video, I give you four tips on how to potty train your French Bulldog puppy. These four tips are not the standard tips you'll find in other YouTube videos, like you should use a dog crate. Nevertheless, using a dog crate is a good advice, but I want to give you something different you've never heard of before, so you can work on that thing with your French Bulldog puppy. These four tips come directly from my book, How to House Train Your Puppy, The Ultimate Guide, which I wrote in cooperation with 24 dog trainers and dog experts. Hi, my name is Robin and I'm the owner of the website puppybee.com and I'm here to help you prepare for your puppy in the best way possible so you know what to expect and what to do when you get a puppy. Besides my book How to House Train Your Puppy The Ultimate Guide, I've written three other puppy training books and I've written these four books in cooperation with over 30 well-known dog trainers. And again, these four tips I'm going to share with you in this video come directly from my book How to House Train Your Puppy The Ultimate Guide. My first tip for you is to take your French Bulldog puppy outside immediately also when your puppy is still 8 to 12 weeks old. What do I mean with this? Well, some vets still advise you not to take your puppy outside until it has received all its vaccinations. That would mean your puppy can only pee in the garden to prevent it being infected by other dogs. This in turn would mean that your pup is not allowed to leave your home and garden for up to 12 weeks resulting in an insecure and anxious dog. The second socialization stage of a puppy's life covers the period between 8 and 12 weeks of age. During this crucial period puppies need to be socialized to fit in with the society. They need to gain positive experiences with the things they will encounter later on in life. If you never let your puppy get familiar with traffic for instance, you run a serious risk of having it respond anxiously to all traffic later on. In short, it would be very harmful to restrict your French Bulldog's puppy's world to just your home and garden over the period between 8 and 12 weeks of age. Besides, this is a good practice for socializing your puppy, it is also very good for house training your French Bulldog puppy. You probably prefer that your pup will pee and poop outside rather than inside or in your garden. So why not take it outside immediately instead of letting it pee and poop in your garden first. My second tip for you is to stop using the confusing rules of thumb. Some people use a rule of thumb in puppy house training regimes. An example of such rules of thumb is the following. A two month old French bulldog pup can retain urine for three hours. For every month that it ages, add one hour to this number. This means that when your French bulldog aged three months, it can wait four hours before having to pee. Despite what may be roughly accurate in general, the best advice is to not use a rule of thumb when rearing pups, including house training regimes. Every single dog is unique and all sorts of different factors affect the pace of the house training process. If you do operate by a rule of thumb, you run the risk of focusing too heavily on that rule. If your puppy should somehow pee inside the house, you are likely to think that something is wrong with it, which will not help the process of rearing your pup. On top of this, there are dozens of factors influencing the length of time that any pup can go without a pee. Consider fluid intake, for instance or the metabolic rate of its body or the level of activity and anxiety it experiences. It is by no means exceptional for an 8 week old puppy to need to pee after only 20 minutes of intense activity. On the other hand, puppies may well sleep the entire night without having to go if they're resting peacefully. So in conclusion, do not use a rule of thumb when house training your French Bulldog puppy. Instead, just focus your attention on your puppy and look at his behavior and previous activities. Have you just had a play session with your puppy? Take it outside first before putting them back in its dog crate. Running, walking and playing will result in your puppy having to pee much sooner than expected according to the rule of thumb. My third tip for you is to find the dullest place close to your home for your French Bulldog puppy to pee and poop during his first week. Why dull you wonder? Well, many people ask me all the time how can a pup that's just been walked 
be indoors only five minutes later. The thing to keep in mind is a puppy's endless curiosity. As you take it for a walk, it is usually so focused on its surroundings that if you don't give it a clear opportunity to pee or to poop, you run the risk of allowing it to forget all about nature's call. Once you get home, it calms down and suddenly realizing why you went for that walk in the first place. Try to imagine yourself in a situation. You wouldn't be able to take a whiz with everyone around you watching you because you would be too tense. You would be much more relaxed if you went to the toilet and focused on the task at hand all by yourself. And this is the reason you want your pup to get bored and relax, making it realize that it needs to pee and poo. Any place in your immediate surroundings that provides minimum distractions will do. During this first week, use the same boring spot as often as you can to teach the pup where it can and should answer nature's call. Repeatedly visiting the same spot makes it even more boring for your puppy, causing it to switch attention to peeing sooner. If you notice that it's working out nicely, you can start looking for a second airing space. Try to find more and more different airing spots to teach a French Bulldog puppy to relieve itself in different places. On the grass, in the sand, on the gravel and even on the pavement if you're living in an urban area without a spot of green nearby. My fourth tip for you is to not leave a puppy of 8 weeks home alone for longer than 2 hours on end because you'll run the risk of having it to pee or poop indoors. Many people wonder how long they can leave a puppy home alone because they need to get back to their full-time jobs a few weeks or even a few days after taking a puppy into their home. It's best to take a vacation of a minimum of three weeks to cover the initial arrival of your new puppy. When you need to get back to your job after, you could also consider a dog walking service or you could ask a friend, neighbor or a family member to walk your puppy when you're not around. You need to remember that puppies have small bladders and because of that they need to pee very often. That is why it's so important to consistently stick to the walking schedule. You can download my walking sleep and eating schedule for free I specifically created for you and your French Bulldog puppy. You can find a link to the free French Bulldog walking schedule in the link in the description below this video or you can go to my website puppyb.com. And my bonus tip for you is to check out my other YouTube video I recently published also about potty training. In this other video I give you six tips on how to potty train your puppy. These are not the same tips I discussed in this video, so you definitely hear something new. Well there you have it, my four tips plus one bonus tip on potty training your French Bulldog puppy. To quickly summarize the four tips, tip one Take your French Bulldog puppy outside immediately, also when your puppy is still 8 to 12 weeks old. And we do this because it is very important to socialize your puppy immediately with traffic and such. Tip 2. Stop using the confusing rules of thumb. Every dog is unique and each day is different. Instead of using a rule of thumb, focus on your dog and act accordingly. Tip 3. Find the dullest place close to your home for your French Bulldog puppy to pee and poop during its first week. This will prevent it to pee inside after you walk 5 minutes later. And the last tip, the fourth tip, do not leave a puppy of 8 weeks home alone for longer than 2 hours on end because you run the risk of having it pee or poop indoors. You walk your French Bulldog puppy 4 times a day but you could be taking it for a pee and poop for as many as 14 times a day walks included. And also my last bonus tip, check out my other YouTube video on potty training your puppy with six other tips and you'll find a link to that video in the description below this video. I hope you find at least one tip you didn't know yet so you can work on that thing. If you liked my video about potty training your French Bulldog puppy, please giving it a thumbs up so I know I need to make more videos like this. Please visit my website puppyb.com for more information about puppy training. And last but not least, please leave a comment below this video and tell me what name you will give your French Bulldog puppy. Or if you have given it a name already, I am very curious what its name is. Leave a comment below and tell me. Also, do you have an Instagram account for your French Bulldog puppy? Promote it in the comments below so I can follow your dog on Instagram. I would really like that. I wish you all the best with your French Bulldog puppy and make sure you enjoy every moment. Thank you for watching my video and I'll see you next time.